Hello, Scorpio gang, gang, gang. Hope all is well with you guys. To my Scorpio kisses. Mm -hmm. I love, 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 love you guys to the moon and fucking back. You know that. To my returning OG subscribers, what's popping, what's good. To my newly subscribed, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for allowing the channel to continue to grow. I appreciate that shit. This is Scorpio Affair, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node. Anywhere you got Scorpio placements in your chart. Grab your boo, your hookah, your blunt, your spliff, your coffee, your tea, your vodka, your gin. Okay, your whiskey, your fine cognac. I heard that do say. Your hand, whatever it takes to stay tapped into these energies like we always do around about this time. If you should see an ad, let it play for a minute or so so your girl can get all the credit from YouTube. If you like a personal reading with me, you need to be a part of the members only community. Catch me on a live or when I'm running a special. Anything else you need to know is in the description box below. To all of you rock stars who like, share, subscribe, donate to the channel, leave kind words of encouragement, join the membership, and let my ads play. You totally fucking rock. I'm sending you all the love and light your heart can hold and your energy can match. Multiply tenfold. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Let's get into the messages. Pull my nose itching. What's the messages for Scorpio? I just heard you a hybrid like Moses. And then I'm asking them, why is Moses, how is Moses a hybrid? And they said he was born a Hebrew, but he was raised by Pharaoh. So he's both, he, he had both, the best of both worlds. I'm also hearing too, your name could be Octavia, Tavia. Okay, no, that's not a name. Well, it's a name. Tavia. Um, somebody tell me what Tavia means. I don't. They're not even showing me how to spell it. I'm hearing it. Tavi. Ta Tava. I'm hearing Tava. Something very significant with that and Moses, maybe. Somebody let me know in the comments. I'm also hearing somebody's. Somebody's ancestors worked in the courts of Pharaoh. I don't know what the courts mean. Maybe that means like in his house or like was a maid or something like that. Worked in his courts. I'm also hearing um, the daughter of God. I keep, they keep showing me T's, 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 T's. Okay. I also just heard God is everywhere because we're everywhere and he's in us. Okay. Okay. Some of y'all were carried by a Tava. A Tava, a Tava. Carried by a Tava. Carried by What's the energy with Scorpio? The Queen of Pentacles is coming out in the reverse. A lot of you Scorpios could not be feeling yourself right now. You could be feeling ungrounded. You could be feeling like, you know, you could be really going through something spiritually, like letting go of old beliefs. Um... I feel like you're in the energy of, of, of being carried. I feel like you're being carried. Whatever that Tava, I don't know, Tava, I don't, I don't know. I think I'm hearing Tava. Whatever it is, I know it carries, it carries you. Cause I feel like, I feel like you're being carried now that you're in the queen of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like you at a point in your life where everybody's left you except God. Okay. You don't have any money to give nobody. You don't have any favors for nobody to ask for. It's almost as if God put you in this place. 
I'm, I'm hearing like, yo, who you are is bigger than who who you've been around or how much money you made or you can't be you can't be equated to those things. And I feel like that's why you're showing up. This is almost like a death and rebirth too. I'm getting that with this Queen of Pentacles because for whoever I'm speaking to right now, I don't know if I'm speaking to you, Scorpio Cross Watcher. But it appears like your your luck has changed. See the rabbit in the reverse with the Queen of Pentacles? It appears that way. It's an illusion. This is really what's going on. You're being free. You were always abundant. I just feel like you're you're awakening to some type of knowledge. I feel like, you know, you go through this uprooting and you feeling off because it's all you ever know. For some some of you Scorpios, this could be Christianity. Because I feel like with the Queen of Pentacles, you're being uprooted and carried by God to another place. You know, like he's showing you something higher here with the Nine of Pentacles. It's like he unearthed you only to plant you somewhere firmer, some, somewhere more fertile. Look at that, the Nine of Pentacles. And to get everybody from around you while he did it. Yeah, look, I can't make this shit up. This ain't about a level up. This is just about you walking into, um, oh, no, nah, they say this ain't about you walking. This is about God carrying you somewhere. This is where your purpose begins. Whatever this Teva Tarva is, this is where your journey starts. It starts with God carrying you again. Go listen to the message that I just did. Something very significant about birth, trimesters, abortions miscarriages mother earth mother cursed karmic mother premature babies six of swords on the bottom of the deck you're being carried somewhere like i said by a boat a tava i don't know what this is they keep because i don't i i keep hearing it tava I don't know if that's a Hebrew word. It has something to do with Moses. It also has something to do with Noah, they just said. So is it an ark? It's a boat. Okay, it's some type of boat. Something very significant about you being a water sign. It's almost like you can calm the seas. It's almost like you, you're not afraid of water. I'm hearing you, you're being carried. By God, you're being separated from the herd. You're a hybrid. Three of cups at the bottom of the deck. You, you're like three different, you have three different ancient bloodlines running through your veins. Go watch that, that um, video I just did for Scorpio before this one. Mm-hmm. Somebody is carrying you to freedom, not somebody, God. <laughs> Thank you, so as God said, not somebody, me. It don't matter what it looked like. That's what, who am I talking to? You so concerned about what it looked like to you don't even know you're a hybrid like Moses. You don't even know that your direct ancestors worked in the courts of Pharaoh. They saw God work. Your ancestors are giving you live testimonies. Yeah, I'm hearing you, your ancestors, they lived in they lived different lives in different eras. So did you. Some of y'all don't remember. Your ancestors are carrying you to this, showing you this. God is showing you it's a reason why you feel the way you do. It's a reason why you're being uprooted. Look, because of your future. Because of your purpose, being realized, what you found out you got to do now. Mm -hmm. On the bottom of the deck, the five of swords in reverse. Mm -hmm. Somebody got their head on straight now. Somebody, somebody is coming to the realization that, you know, this was this was planned. This was orchestrated by God. You a hybrid. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm also hearing like it was people on the earth. 
three of pentacles I just saw when Noah got where he was going when the ark settled down, wherever it settled down. There was already people here. You can't keep reproducing on the same bloodline. Like, period. Some of y'all was hybrids. I'm hearing the people that was here. Your ancestors, where Moses went to, where the, where the ark landed, they were hybrids. Where Moses landed, it was Pharaoh's sister, the daughter of God. Thank you, Source. Bring it together. Bring it together, Source. The daughter of God was Pharaoh's. Is that Was that his sister his daughter? Because, see, Pharaoh thought he was a god. Come on through, Source. Flow through me, channel. See, Pharaoh thought he was a god. And he could have been one of the gods, but he was not God. Yeah, I'm hearing Pharaoh, let my people go. Who is Pharaoh? I feel like Pharaoh is money. Pharaoh is you, Pharaoh is you being idle minded. Pharaoh is you not making a decision about your life and your beliefs. I, 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 I get the energy that you're being, you're being, you're being carried. Into your greatness. You're being carried. Full term by God. Now I don't know what that means. Something very significant Scorpio. About you in 90 days. For some of y'all it's 120. For some of y'all it's 180. For some of y'all it's 360. 10 lunar months. I want to clarify this energy. Clarify this queen of pentacles in reverse. For some of y'all, y'all y'all are three-dimensional. You know, like, I ain't talking about three-dimensional being. I'm talking about, like, you got three different types of ancestry flowing through your, your veins. It makes you so different than everybody else. That now you're being carried by God. Yeah, you're being carried by God because some of your ancestors worked under... Pharaoh's court. Yeah, your ancestors could have been Hebrew. They were uprooted. Oh, glory to God. Thank you, source. Keep it coming. Your ancestors was uprooted from their heritage. Oh, but Moses set them free. Why? Because Moses was carried by God. Moses was born in those years where they were supposed to kill him. And his mama put him in a basket, so a, a table got to be a basket or a boat or something, anything, I guess, that float on water. That's just common sense now from the messages I'm getting. When your mission is a test of free and not just you, see, see, his mama put him in the water to free him from the death. He was the one that was in imminent danger, but... The Bible talks about his mama knowing he was special. The Bible always also talks about his brother Aaron who protected him and, and smothered him, basically trying to keep him quiet from, the, from Pharaoh's people coming to kill the firstborn sons. Who am I talking to? He was being carried then. Oh, my God. Glory to God. Come on through, source. He was being carried then by his older brother. How many, y'all just don't know how many times God said, you don't know how many times I tava. I gave you a tava. He said, you don't, you don't, you don't understand how many rides I gave you. Physical rides, projected rides, visions. Because you, you three dimensional. I keep hearing somebody three dimensional. Your brain don't work like everybody's work. And when you have something you short of, God will send somebody with you to compensate for it. But guess what? You the one with the message. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm going back to my Christian rules now because I'm hearing God say, Aaron, Aaron spoke eloquently. Who am I talking to? Oh, yeah, you, you got some on here. They, sp they speak it well. They got the gift of gal. Mm -hmm. God gave it to them. Because, see, Moses stuttered. Oh, glory to God. Bring the message then. So, he, he dealt with fears. But God said, I'm going to use you anyway. Because can't nobody go to Pharaoh and say, let my people go but you, Moses, with the stutter. Okay? No, with the drunkenness. Can't nobody build my ark but you. 
Who am I talking to? Who think they, because they flawed, they not chosen? Okay, I'm gonna keep going. I'm trying. I'm trying to clarify. Who think cause they got a stutter, they ain't supposed to start their YouTube channel? Okay, God said I use anybody, and look who He always using. He always using using people the world look at as as something under their shoe, and they be hybrids like Moses. God sent them to their life because they hybrid like Moses. Okay, I'm gonna help somebody out in a minute. Clarify about this Queen of Pentacles in reverse. The Nine of Pentacles again. What what your ancestors said? What your ancestors said? Yeah, we uprooted you. Yeah, we uprooted you. Yeah, we yeah we gave you a ride. We giving you a ride right now to freedom. Somebody getting a ride to freedom. Two Nine of Pentacles. Spirit really want to bring this home. That you free. I don't know who need to hear that you free. You're a hybrid like Moses. Don't don't let your don't let your impediments that God gave you deter you from delivering the message. Cause we got a lot of people that speak eloquently to the people. <laughs> oh glory, God! Thank you for knowing what people need. The nine of Pentacles. God said, "I'll send your brother Aaron, who told you before." See, the only reason Aaron was able to told him then was because he told him he saved his life back there. Who am I talking to? You don't just get an access pass to Scorpio life because you my brother, my mother, my sister. Who saved my life? That's who get access. Who got purpose in my life? That's who get access. Oh, I feel like preaching the Ten of Cups. Y'all worry about money. God said y'all keep asking me and worrying about shit I already gave you already. I already gave you my word. I don't need nobody to vouch for me. Who am I talking to? So the Queen of Pentacles being clarified by the Nine of Pentacles again with the Ten of Cups. Mm -hmm. Let my people go so they can go in the woods and worship. Let them go so they can go in the woods and worship their God. He too, he too busy thinking. Pharaoh was too busy thinking he was a God. This who Pharaoh is. Any Pharaoh, anybody living to this day who think they above God, you the straight fucking devil. God uprooted you though from Pharaoh. Oh, glory. Who am I talking to? Who I'm helping God? Put down in the chat, God carrying you right now. He gave you a, he gave you a, a, a table. I don't even know how to spell it. What I said, he gave you a table. There you go again, the eight of wands. He gave you a ride to freedom. Mm-hmm. With your speech impediments. Yeah, uh-huh. With your little bit of money in the bank. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, you. Not you, but you. <laughs> The one who was supposed to be dead by now because of the witchcraft. The one who was supposed to be dead now because of the car wreck. The one who was supposed to be under the bridge because they stole their inheritance. You, Scorpio. Give me one more on this Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody thought they was, oh, glory to God. Somebody thought they was putting you up under a bridge, girl. Somebody thought you weren't going to be able to do it because you stuttered, because your eyes was brown, because you came from a different place. Your ancestors say, oh, no, 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 baby. This illusion. This is what I want them to see. You the master, though. The eight of pentacles. These your ancestors working. God said, I already did the work in you. It's taking you this long to know. But God said, when I'm carrying you, when I send you a ride, a chariot, a, t a table, he said, this, this table, it, it ain't about you no more. It, it ain't about, do you want to go? God said, I put you in it. I put you in that, in that, on that ride for a reason. Why? Because I want you to know that I am God. Who need to know God, God? Not you, Scorpio. Not no more. Clear about this nine of pentacles again. You free and abundant. 
No weapon formed against you shall prosper. You're pulling the page of pentacles in reverse. Now they now they being uprooted. Mm -hmm. That's what I said. That's witchcraft. They being uprooted. The king of wands in reverse. Mm -hmm. Now everything they try and going to hell and back. But these people of eloquent speech. These are people with degrees. These are people who have businesses that flourish for years. God bless them. Who am I talking to? For years, God bless them. And then boom, the two, two of wands. The two of wands, judgment. The queen of wands, they go, they go his family lineage right there. The, the, the king of wands and the queen of wands in reverse. Uh, for some of y'all, y'all just been, y'all just been, you know, doing what you kind of wanted to do. Y'all been, y'all, y'all haven't been living your life out because you don't think, you think because of whatever it is that you think wrong with you. Is why you can't do what you hear God say do. Who am I talking to? But what you really doing, Scorpio, you keep listening to who keeps saying they made you instead of listening to who created you. Oh, I'm trying to help somebody out. Whoever this king of wands and queen of wands in, re in reverse with this page of pentacles, they see this nine of pentacles and they don't even know what it is. They don't even know. They pharaohs. This king of wands and queen of wands is giving me arrogance. It's giving me Pharaoh and his wife or some shit like that. Like they think they above God. Yeah, look, the king of pentacles. Oh, glory to God. This somebody who think they money going to save them when the locusts come. Mm-hmm, that's what I just heard. This somebody who think they money going to save them when the locusts come. What else? I'm hearing you, you, you got the mark. You're the chosen. And now the pentacles to me is the chosen one. You got it twice. It's like the spirit came past your house, went straight to Pharaoh's house. Who is Pharaoh? Whoever Pharaoh ever been in your life. Whatever Pharaoh that was in your life that told you they weren't going to do what God told you to do. Okay. One more is now the pinnacles. Yeah, look, the fool in reverse. This God hardens Pharaoh hard right here. This is the story of Moses. This your story. You could be Moses. Shit. 22, 22, 33 on the time my nose itching. You could be Moses. Because I'm hearing the, the fall of the king. The king of pentacles. The king of wands. The king of who he thought. He thought he was. Oh, he thought because his his livestock was plentiful. God killed every god dang on one of them. See, when God do something, he let you know it wasn't just a fluke. The Bible say all, all Pharaoh livestock was dead. I keep hearing that then the locusts came. <laughs> oh, glory. The emperor sitting in the middle of your reason. I'm here, you sitting pretty while he toting you. Yeah, they see you like the queen of pentacles in reverse now, but wait till they see you in this... Parade of water. That's what I just heard. Yeah, the four swords in reverse. Where did they see you up and about rejoicing? You ain't no longer sackcloth and bound to your fears and stuck on stupid. God just showed you the miracles of your staff that he gave you when he told you to put it out. Whatever he told you it was going to do when you believed it, it happened. Who am I talking to? The eight of cups. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I want to talk to somebody who's brave and courageous, not somebody who ain't scared to be on their own path. Yeah, that's who I'm talking to. I'm talking about somebody who God put in a table. I'm talking about he carried you to greatness. Uh-huh. The four ones, you could be seeing four, four, four. I'm hearing one, two, three. The four ones, God said, you, you, you homeless. Let me give you a home now. See, everything they thought they was taking, everything Pharaoh thought he had was because of, of God's people, was because of Moses' people. And you wouldn't even let them people worship their God. Pharaoh thought he was being blessed because of him being a God. Him talking to all the other gods, but the one God he wasn't talking to was the one creator who was over everything. Who, am I who keep talking to all these other gods? When you a hybrid like Moses, 
when your ancestors were in the court of Pharaoh, when they're showing you blueprints of what happened when they was there, when they're giving you visions, downloads of what to do, instruction. Who am I talking to? God is everywhere because he's in you and you everywhere. Somebody realizing that somebody woke up to that this morning. Yeah, you could be seeing four, four, four. They go that four pentacles again. Somebody, somebody releasing fears. Somebody releasing their fear right now. Somebody realizing they actually being, in, they in their table. You in your table now. You're being carried to freedom. That's why you broke. <laughs> That's why you homeless. Uh-huh. Yep. This too shall pass. What I said. I'm channeling spirit, but thus said the Lord. And everybody, everybody that thinks, see, this is the thing too about you being whatever you went through. People think it was the witchcraft. People think it was them, you know, karma, whatever. No, for Scorpio, this was God. This was God guiding you. This was God giving you all the L's in life, lessons. You don't have no losses. You'll lose more in life than people will have, so loss don't even equate in your life. The five of cups, what did I just say? You lose more shit, you gonna lose, you lost more shit than people will ever have in a lifetime. The five of cups is here because loss is a part of your life. So is gain, Scorpio, what I said. Clarify the six of swords for Scorpio. Yeah, somebody releasing limiting beliefs and fears. Yeah, the five of swords, you getting this twice in the reverse. On six of swords, somebody somebody ain't too keen about your movement now. You moving different. You moving like a hybrid. You moving like Moses. How are you moving in a table? You're being carried. Yeah, a lot of people know you were being carried. You didn't know it. You know now. What I always tell you, that chariot always waiting on Scorpio. We didn't know it was a table, though. The page of cups in reverse. God, God said, you know what? Not only am I going to get you... Get you somewhere where people are not lying to your face about loving you. Where people are not manipulating you. Where people are not talking bad about you. God said, not only am I going to do that, but I'm going to take you to a place where they can't, they, they, you don't hear the shit. It's still going on. But where you going, you won't be able to hear it. <laughs> what else on the six of fours? Your mission bigger than gossip, Scorpio, malicious or otherwise. Your, your life is bigger than twin flames and soulmates. The two of pentacles is in the reverse. God said, when I get ready to turn anything around, I'll do it. Anything around. You're no longer financially stressed anymore. You're no longer, you know, in this gray area. You're standing firm, Scorpio, on what you believe. Your belief system changed. Yeah, look, the queen of pentacles again coming out in the reverse. You know why? Because once you move on, they move into that energy. But it ain't your energy. They truly broke. The page of wands, they start, they, luckily for them, they get a, a do-over. But the do-over is to orchestrate what they already orchestrated. Yeah, look, the moon. Yeah, these people don't know what they got coming. And you don't either, Scorpio, because God is carrying you right now. You're, you're in this moment of uncertainty and, you know, but it's because of what you always believe. You're in this uncertainty with this moon because you fear God. You don't want to do nothing that's contrary to God, but God is leading you somewhere else. He's leading you away from the dark into the light so that you know what's going on with world systems. Like, I feel like, yeah, look at this, the king of swords. Somebody, somebody. Somebody ancestors from Pharaoh's court, they're trying to tell you something about world systems, about numbers. That's why you keep seeing signs and synchronicities of numbers. They're trying to tell you about the world system. Pharaoh was one of the richest kings ever. Like, and your ancestors are trying to tell you how to access this wealth or how to access whatever this mission is, purpose is God have for you here. Yeah, which leads me to the three of wands right now as we challenging that. Clarify this three of wands. Something very significant about your future. Yeah, look, the ace of pentacles. There's a new start here, a new beginning. Something about money systems. I'm getting that very significantly. Some of y'all could be bank tellers. You could work at the bank. You could have a lot of money in the bank. Something really is connecting you to world systems, money systems. I'm getting that. The seven of wands is also here. 
Somebody, somebody is, somebody is releasing the fear of losing money. Cause you're very abundant. And I feel like whoever this is that's in this seven of wands energy, I feel like that's another reason why God is, is carrying you now. It's like you too strong for your damn self. You don't know when it's time to ask for help. What I said, the judgment. So God got to kind of like bridle you a little bit. Okay. That's the reason why you, you being carried right now at the table. Give me three more. We're going to get out of here. Yeah, the Ten of Swords, the King of Cups in reverse, and the Ace of Wands. Yeah, so I feel like uh, you 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 really like ending some some emotional baggage is here, Scorpio. I feel like when God is carrying you, yeah, the Three of Cups. I feel like that's a time for you to like really do a lot of soul searching. That's a time when he wants other people to think that you just under, that you've gone down, that you, you know, you're beyond repair. You know, you somebody that stutters, so you couldn't have a message from God. You somebody who ain't got a million views, so you, you can't be reading tarot type shit. But God is saying, don't worry about what they saying, because I'm finna take you to a place where you won't even hear it. All right, Scorpio, if you still with me, like, share, subscribe. Let those ads play. I love you guys so, so much. Y'all know we go together real bad. I'll see you in the next video.